Killing Starfield. Ship Tigger is low if it drops your weight. Okay. Pressing it. Why is it not repairing? I don't know what's going on. Ah, oh, beat me up. What I, was I not repairing it? Anyways, you're with the creatures hanging out. What's up? A different approach. better I just jumped into that when I hit record forgot where I left off can I salvage your stuff I lost ships. Go up here. I can I take their stuff. Okay, so uh, yeah, so I can take this ship. All right, there's that law. How far? Seven twenty-one. Do we have any other ones that we need to still? Oh, was not paying attention to that. Ran into it. It doesn't prompt you. You know? I gotta repair my ship when I get back. Where's this other outlaw ship? Got all three of them. Cool. Points. All right, let's see.
check something real quick. Okay, my first assignment as a freelance ranger, pub tech. This is what we want to do. Okay, let's go land. How are you doing today? Got into a tenth battle, didn't realize that. I was going to jump into a, a, a firefight. Selling the ship? Getting a new one? <laughs> well, this is the place to do it, I guess. Nice. Hold on real quick. Let me pause this. All right. Back again. Had Probably have to edit that video. Uh, I had a phone call. Let's see. Hope Tech. We're at Hope Tech. Can buy ships here? Wait, wait. Let's talk. Oh, Do I have gear I can sell here? Was that your <laughs> stomach or mine? Ah, yes. Shuffle time. Let's see if we can even the load. All right. That's all you have. Mm -hmm. Do any of my guys have stuff? I think I gave stuff to one of the guys. Let's double check before we get out. Because I always forget to sell stuff. There What's you the are. Part, there you are. Let's talk. Good to see you again. Good to see you too, buddy. What do you have for me? What do you have for me? Let's see what we got. That's all he has. See you later. Is this my other guy? Nope, that's Barrett. Where are you hiding out in the dark? I think it's him. I gave him stuff. My pack is your pack. What? So sweet of you. Okay, so we'll take all. See you later. Let's get out of here now. Selling the ship. Getting a new one? <laughs> well, this is the place to do it, I guess. Let's go sell stuff. Uh, let's see what they have. Remember, always look before you sell so you don't get confused with what you have. All right, so we're going to sell that guy. You have no coins. And I'll go over here and sell them. Not in there. Over here, best defense. Hey. Say something rude to me. Ready to do some business. Yeah. Music to my ears. So, so I, I heard them all so I know what to sell. It's a little fun thing to do. Alright, so we don't need that guy. Even though this one's really cool, I don't need to carry it. So we need to sell it somewhere else. What's this one? I just I should just keep this one and this one. Because the way you carry. Is always nice. This one uses a magic pack, so I need to get rid of this bounty one. Uh, 
Okay, you ran out of money. Yes. Hope tech, let's go. Hope tech. I don't want to hear any complaints. Thank you, sweetie. Let's go talk to this lady. You made it. Those outlaws didn't give you too much trouble, I trust? No trouble at all. They put up a good fight, but I got them in the end. I'm lucky to be alive. First things first, how are you feeling? I can walk, talk, and breathe without too much pain. That's good enough for me. I'm sure they didn't want to die any more than you did. That's true. It's a pointless and stupid waste of life, but... They brought it on themselves. You've got good timing. A courier just came in from Aquila. The marshal sends his regards along with a briefing on your case. I was surprised as hell to learn about the starship theft. Nobody said a word to me about it. Anyway, Mr. Hope can see us whenever you're ready. If you need to take a little time first, feel free. Let's me Hope. His office is upstairs. He's in a meeting, but it should be wrapping up. Come on. Hope you took off. Hope Tech is the everyday working person ship. Council oversees the Free Star Rangers, so don't rile them up. I've spent a long time trying to build a good relationship with Hope. <laughs> he comes on a little strong, but there's a lot to admire about the man. Everything you see around you, he built. Pretty much everyone in this town owes him for their livelihood. Can't begin to imagine the kind of pressure that must put on someone. All I'm saying is, try to show a little respect. All the way up. Is it just me, or does every executive in the settled systems have an office on the top floor? Uh, I guess and text and walk at the same time as I work it. Well, <laughs> above everyone. Woo. Yeah, I'm paying attention now. Contract with scavengers, maybe, but that's a decision that's got to be made upstairs. Hmm. Well, talk to Elaine about the scavengers. It's not a bad idea, provided we get a good deal. And I don't mean a fair deal. I mean a good deal. Remember, it's not just our bottom line that matters here. We're also responsible for the welfare of everyone in the factory. We look out for our people here, Virgin. That's a point of great personal pride. Um, excuse me, uh, Mr. Hope? Well, now, the Free Star Rangers. At last! <laughs> ah, damn, good to see you here. I think we're done here, Virgin. Yes, sir. <coughs> this is the deputy I told you about. Splendid. Splendid! It's a noble calling, being a Free Star Ranger. Mm, we certainly could use more of you. Yeah, get up and talk to him, huh? Yeah, come over here. Let's get down to it, shall we? Time is money. I'm sure I don't have to tell you what an outrage it is to have a ship stolen right out of the factory. Oh, justice must be done, and the sooner the better. No, to be simple. Standard with extra cargo. Are you sure? I changed the order. One yeah. time. That's good news. I'll send my people over to bring it home. Of course, that doesn't mean your work is done. Darn it, I wanted that. be found and prosecuted to the full extent of the law. I'm sure I don't need to remind you of my position on the Council of Governors. Yes, sir, Mr. Hope, you can count on me. I'm aware of your position. Don't, I don't give a damn about your position. <laughs> then 
I trust that you know what I expect of you. Now, Whoa. tell me that you've at least got a lead of some. He's imp he's privileged, entitled. Okay. Though what happened after the ship was taken doesn't concern me, what does concern me is making sure that this doesn't happen again. Well, I'm not sure I can be much help, but I'll answer whatever questions I can. All right. Because I told them not to. Oh. If word got out. It would do irreparable harm to our image. I'm in fierce competition with other Starship manufacturers. Any sign of weakness could be fatal. Uh, what's more, every Starship thief in the settled systems would, would likely flock to Hopetown and start planning the next heist. What? Nonsense. Nonsense. Thoroughly here. Hope Tech holds its employees to the very highest standards. What a shocker. Nevertheless, I suppose I could have Cosette conduct a, a thorough personnel review. Rest assured, if we turn up any evidence that one of our people was an accomplice, I'll let you know. We questioned everyone who was in the building when it happened. And not one person seems to have seen anything at all. Interesting. Frankly, I think that's both highly unlikely and more than a little suspicious. However, I can't deny there are times when the hangar is empty. So it's not inconceivable the thief could have slipped in unseen. No, nothing at all. It was just a, a standard Hope Tech cargo hall. Not that it didn't have great value, mind you. Hope Tech builds some of the most durable and reliable starships in the settled systems. Now, you can bet my ships last twice as long as anything Stroud Eklund makes. All right. Stroud Eklund. Very well. I need you to understand something, Deputy. Okay, what? This town is home to men, women, and children who depend on Hope Tech for a living. I provide jobs that put food on their tables and a roof over their heads. It's a responsibility that I take very seriously. Very seriously. If word gets out about the stolen ship, my investors will lose trust and my workers will pay the price. I can't allow that. Mm -mm, no way I'd want to be in your shoes, Mr. Hope. Having all those people depending on me, I don't think I'd sleep at night. I'd be lying if I said I hadn't suffered my share of sleepless nights. The thought of, of seeing these people go hungry as well. Oh, it's more than I can bear. You can count on my distract. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I'm I don't know how to read. I need to go back to school. I'm sorry to interrupt, Mr. Hope, but there's Who is that? I want her. Not now, Cosette. I'm in the middle of something. But, sir, we have new information. I've just received a report that the stolen ship was seen landing at Neon just after the theft. Hey. Hey, well, Cosette. It sounds like you'll be heading to Neon, which means I can get back to work. Remember what we discussed. My people are depending on you. Oh, I want to punch you in the face. Can I get a word? Yeah, but ho hold on. We'll get a word, but hi. Hello? Tell me some information. Enjoy your visit to Hope Tech. You busy? If you'll excuse me, I am on duty. I like your outfit. Mr. I... Hope is a vital part of not only Polvo, but of the entire Freestar Collective. I like you. 
Sorry, I can't talk now. Oh, wait. That wasn't as helpful as it could have been. Still, at least you know where to pick up the trail. Yeah, me too. So, guess you're headed for Neon. There's a ranger station fair. Name's Jalen Price. Jalen Price. He's a little different than the rest of us. But a Neon's a different kind of place. Neon, street rat. I spend time on Neon. I know how different it can be. I don't need anyone help. How is Neon different? What can you tell me about the Ranger Price? Good. That should help you avoid any unnecessary complications. Well, we've both got work to do. It was good to meet you, Deputy. Thanks again for helping me out up there. Thanks for selling up. No problem. Good luck on Neon, Deputy. Nice. Okay. All right, so let's go to Neon. Yep. We're gonna jump there. You can just, you don't even have to get your ship. You just jump. You go pew and take off. Give me a quick scan. Three star, three star, you see, trader. Okay, cool. Finally get to go to Neon. Isn't this like a drug planet on water? Resources. I already found the resources. Okay. Hope Tech has a ship I can buy. Is that what you were telling me, Barrett? See that huge shield? Why not? It's part of the power system. Lightning provides a substantial amount of Neon's energy. Cool. Here we go. Trying to find this other deputy. Some kind of checkpoint ahead. Let's let them do their job so we can move along. Hey, if you're going to talk to me, why are you so far back? Maybe I should put both headsets on. Tevin Anastas has run into some trouble. Word to the wise, you don't want a piece of that. <laughs> yeah? Don't move, Nesha! What the hell is this about? Cut the act. Sniffers picked up the Aurora you're carrying the second you step through. All right, get up slowly and turn around. Try to run and we open fire. I bought this gear and then had to restart my from a mission and I lost it. So, what was the plan, Nesha? Smuggle the Aurora into Aquila City or New Atlantis? No, no, I just forgot I was carrying it. Is all honest mistake, right? Come on, can can we just settle this right here? I can pay the usual. We don't make the rules. That's Administrator Bayo's job. Now. Shut up and start walking. Move it. Let's go. You're Rachel. in trouble. Okay, we gotta speak to him in jail. Yonix got in trouble. We'll have a problem. Come on. No, I'm just trying to activate the platform. We can go up together. We're all friends. You guys were with me. Okay, cool. Mining lounge. Love to hang around here as a kid. And now I realize how dangerous that could be. Cool. Almost went into the wrong building. Alright, we're 
up at outpost. Okay, we're going to talk to this person. Hey, I don't care who you work for. You can't just... Oh, you're the rookie, aren't you? <laughs> Are you drunk? The one and only. One and only. The marshal's message said you were following a lead about a stolen ship. Truth is, a lot of stolen goods flow through here. But this city is real good at keeping its secrets. Even it from is. us. I'm sure people on Neon want to uphold the law. We'll see about that. Hopefully I can count on your help. So you think I should give up? You can count on my help if you play by the rules. This isn't the Keela City. The badge doesn't carry the same weight here. The people who run this place aren't overly concerned about the law. Our job is to keep the peace, make sure the violence doesn't get out of hand. The last thing anyone around here wants is some hotshot deputy looking in every dark corner. Ooh, I might do that. If half the things I've heard about this place are true, then you should listen to him. Oh, okay. I won't cause trouble. The law and justice are flexible concepts. They're absolutes. So you just turn a blind eye. I pick my battles, and I pick them carefully. Our first duty is to protect the people of the Free Star Collective. But sometimes you have to choose which people to protect. Because not everyone is innocent. Ah, rookies. The law might not be flexible, but you are a human who can think. So you better be. Your stolen ship would have had to land at the spaceport. If it was right off the factory floor, it would have stood out. There's a guy I know... Billy Clayton. Hey, Billy. He does maintenance work around the city and keeps an eye on ship traffic for me. Okay. I'll introduce you, but don't expect a favor. I won't. Even if it doesn't cause credits, nothing in Neon is free. Take me to Billy Clayton. Are you sure this format of yours is trustworthy? You get a lot of unwanted visitors. Any advice for a three-star ranger deputy working on Neon? Aren't you worried about that your badge makes you a target here? Yeah, I don't really care about all his stuff. So many people in this universe. Oh, are you sure? This is Neon. There are no guarantees. And who I find trustworthy changes on a daily basis. That's true. You talk to him or don't. It's your call. All right. I appreciate it. Thank you. Of course. Neon's full of desperate people who have nowhere else to turn. For some, it's a drugs. For others, it's gambling. There are a lot of ways to lose everything in this city. My rule is simple. If someone brought it on themselves, then I don't get involved. I thought rangers were supposed to help people in need. People need to learn from their mistakes. From what I've seen... People who learn from their mistakes are not common. Nope. Take me a Billy. Let's go. Jalen. Barrett, you're a jerk. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Barrett. Okay, let's go out. Neon core. Where are you? Oh, I passed you? Jay and I are walking. Yeah, it's pretty impressive how you volunteered to help out with the bank heist in Aquila City. Yeah, I read all the reports. I learned quickly that in Neon, staying informed and staying alive are closely linked. What stood out to me was that you didn't lose a single hostage. No wonder the marshal tried to recruit you right away. If he hadn't, it would have made him look like a fool having some random stranger step in and do the job he couldn't. Now, if someone tried to hold up a bank here, they'd be gunned down without a moment's hesitation. Hostages or not, there are two things you don't do anymore. Whoa, you are talking to me. You didn't finish your story when we get inside. I need to impress that upon you. Because the fact that you think justice is absolute concerns me, Deputy. It's never that simple. Justice can mean different things to different people. And laws can be interpreted and debated. Ranger relies on judgment and intuition. 
to do what's best for the people. I know your power. The free will in SpaceX. Must be nice. You're getting stuck. Okay. He didn't he didn't finish his story when he went through the door. Oh, that's kind of a bummer. But that was uh Look, look, he has all this time he can talk to me. Be careful around here. Not everyone that stays in our sleep crates are reputable. Okay, thank you. She was nice. Frankie's grab and go. Who drinks? Who the? Hey, Billy. You got a second? What? Oh, it's you. Give me a good scare. I thought you were one of Goodman's people. Check. <laughs> Far from it. Our new deputy here is working a case, and I thought you might be able to help. Take it away, rookie. What do you need? Some of these drugs Jalen's talking about. Do you know where we can get some? JK. <laughs> Still on uh, Hope Tech ship landed here recently. I need information on the pilot. Looking for a thief skilled enough to steal a ship from a factory. Tell me what you know about stolen tech, hope tech ships that make it quick and snappy. Right out of the factory? <laughs> Damn, that's pretty impressive. Well, here's the thing. Neon's got no end of shipjackers. I see them come and go every day. It's tough for a guy to remember one from the other. You know what I mean? Neon is nothing if not fishy. Thanks, Barrett. People could be in danger. Don't make me pursue you the hard way. Pay a thousand credits. Maybe this will jug your memory. Should I pay him or should I? People could be in danger. Seems like a nice guy. Yeah, well, I'm one of them. I can help you. But right now my life is in danger and I haven't even done anything wrong. Free Star Rangers are supposed to protect the innocent, right? Neon Street Route, okay. That's part of the job, yeah. You're confusing. You're refusing to cooperate because that would have consequences. Where are you going with this? All right. I admit I've got a bad habit or two. Look, I know your time is valuable. Here's a few credits for your trouble. Now, if you'll just hear me out for a second, I really need your help. You're giving me credits. It's about my brother. He died while still in debt to a syndicate loan shark by the name of Emmett Goodman. Now, Goodman's coming after me to collect. He says if I don't pay up, I'm a dead man. Sorry about your brother. Debt isn't worth a life. Well, on Neon it is. Okay. I'll talk to this loan shark. It's not my problem. Now tell me what you know about this star. Okay, I, I want to help out. But you better make it worth my time. The only one that matters around here. The Sayoka Syndicate. They pretty Ooh. much run the city. Now, that being said, rumor has it that Emmett Goodman is on the outs, so they might not miss him much if he were to disappear. Ooh, you want me to kill him? I swear it on my best set of wrenches. Goodman's holed up in one of the warehouses on Ebb side. Place is uh. locked up tight, but there's a guard who watches the door, and he's got the key. Okay. I'll stay with Billy in case Goodman's men come to collect. They're not stupid enough to tangle with me. Or not all right let's go do some missions i mean not missions some side side missions underbelly This way looks like there's a hallway down there. Or a walkway. Really? You guys all stopped here? Ew. Ew. I don't know, I'm making that sound effect. Just trying to get past everybody. This is 
private property. You'd better keep walking. This is private property. Show badge. I need to persuade so I can get my social skills up. Okay, so we got four of them. I know you'd like to help me if you could. You can't just have anyone go through. I get it. it must be hard for you to say no all the time. You're not getting through. Oh, that wasn't good. I hear you. Whoa, oh, okay. Let me think. What is this person doing? Talk to the man, and then you come right back out. Try anything stupid, and it's your funeral. Yeah, this will get you in. Okay. What is this? Why were you in my way? I'm pushing the guard out of the way. Can I sneak in with me? What's your name? Why did you... <laughs> it's not that easy to highlight you. The hell you are. What? You got a problem? Ooh, I like her. She's feisty. Okay, where do I go? Up here. He is feisty. Something I can do for you, friend. Well, now, always happy to have a visitor. Tell me, what brings you by, friend? Little light on credits, are you? I'm here about the debt you're trying to collect from Billy. Go badge. Your days of preying on desperate people are over. What kind of operation are you running here? Oh, it's awful kind of you to intervene on my behalf. But I think I have the matter well in hand. You don't. Thank you all the same for your concern. Wow. This guy's a real piece of work. Yeah, he's a bad guy. Billy can't pay the debt, and you know it. Let, let this one go. Billy doesn't owe you anything. The debt was his brother's. Don't test me. I'm not in the mood. Oh, I intend you no offense. It just seems to me that you're trying to get involved in business that ain't yours. What's your stake in this anyway? None of your business. I did put in some fear and a scumbag like you sounded like fun. If you think I'm afraid of some loudmouth deputy, you've got a lot to learn. Should I take him out? Let's try persuading him. Then offer me something I want, and I'll consider it. I'm trying to get blood from a stone here. If you don't help me, the Free Star Rangers might hold a grudge. I don't really have time for this. Well, you got something, and something's better than nothing. Charms. How much time you've got isn't my problem. Seems to me like you're a long way from... Okay, I can't do anything for him. You come walking in here drunk on your newfound authority. Oh, I want to fight I'm you guys. some small-time crook you can push around. Maybe it's time I show you how we resolve disagreements here in Neon. I needed a better gun. Okay, let's. We're gonna steal that, but you're gonna have bad guys down here. Oh, so easy. You stay down there. You have powerful guns like this. It's so easy. Powerful.
Where's Butthead? Oh. Anything else while I'm in here that I can take? Let's open this. I want this one. Oh. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I sneeze. Undo. I do not have the locks for it. I wonder what I do. I have to do one of these first. There we go. Nice first lock pick since I got back in. I love when I open these and there's nothing in them. Oh wow, we actually have something in this one. I've unlocked like three or four uh, pieces and there were nothing in the weapon pieces waste my picks nothing and all this stuff in the warehouse there's nothing exciting in here We're going to be fighting outside. You guy. What? Is it that ship? That's loud. That was really loud. The ship going off. I like it, Neon. I could do whatever and they don't attack me here. Hmm. Okay, where, where am I going? I'm going the wrong way. Sounds good. So is there a different way over here? that route. Yeah, I can. I can run all over. Run up on the top. Below me. Oh, yeah. I've seen them at least. They hit the 
bars, buy a lot of drinks, and talk of how great they are, how they're, you know. Did you talk to Goodman? Oh, we did. Unfortunately, came to violence. Didn't work out well for him. I took care of it. You don't need to know how. I solved your little problem. I didn't mean to put you in harm's way. I was hoping he'd come around when he saw you were a Free Star Ranger deputy. Nope. Took me about a week on the job to learn that doesn't usually work around here. Okay. Time for me to keep my end of the bargain. Yeah. The woman you're looking for is named Grace Early. Stealing ships is her line of work. She usually comes here to sell the goods. Rumor has it she just finished a job for some mercenary outfit. And she's been throwing money around, so must have paid well. I know her. When she isn't out on a job, she's a regular at Madame Sauvage's. That's on the upper platform. I'll back you up. Nice. Okay, confront Grace. All right, we're going to stop here, and we'll continue with Grace here in a moment.